those things! Oh, God! Over here! Over here! Can be killed. Where's Finn? He was over there! Finn! They're everywhere! We make for the North Grove! But we need to stick together! I hope you're right about this, Garrett. Your Grace. You're familiar with my brother's chambers, aren't you? Certainly you've been here before. You looked rather confused when you came in. Yes, Your Grace. I'd like to think we can be honest with one another. However, you're quite the curiosity, aren't you? You profess to be loyal to the Crown, yet you're not very loyal to Lady Marjorie. Have I displeased you, Your Grace? I've heard things. I understand you've been quite busy. Tell me, do you consider yourself an honest, loyal handmaiden? One can never tell with you northern girls. Assuming an honest person exists in King's Landing. It hasn't been easy, Your Grace, but I've done what I've needed to do. Haven't we all? I've done my best to keep an open mind about people like you, yet Lucan tells me you've invited yourself to Tommen's coronation party. How exactly did that happen? It can't have been easy. I do what's necessary, Your Grace. Including using another girl to talk your way in, I'm told. You're not above using people to get what you want. Good. Why would you be so reckless as to risk your neck for what? It all seems rather careless, considering the consequences. My family is still very much at risk, Your Grace. It was crucial I attend. Your family 
Sometimes that's a convenient lie we tell ourselves. When I suspect your issue with Lord Andros played a part in it. You've been such a busy little handmaiden. I assume Lady Marjorie knew nothing of this. No, Your Grace. This wasn't the first time you've hidden the truth from her. You've no qualms about lying to her, have you? Tell me the truth. Your secret is safe with me. Only when I must, Your Grace. I think we both know it's more often than that. Perhaps I mistook your northern stubbornness for ignorance, but now I see there's more to you. You're a cunning girl, and perhaps you can help me. Your Grace? You're quite friendly with my brother Tyrion. I need you to speak with him before the trial begins. I want to know who he intends to call as a witness on his behalf. Consider it a favor to the crown, for which we will all be grateful. I'll make sure she does as she's told, Your Grace. Fair enough. You may prove to be a useful little bird to me, assuming you do as you're told. In return, I'll take care of your problem with Lord Andros. Thank you, Your Grace. I never liked the man anyway, and I doubt anyone will miss him. You think we hired this boat for nothing? No, I don't know. That was a rousing speech you gave, little brother. But who knows how much they heard. Ever since you left me to that dragon, I've given a lot of thought to staying here. Leaving you to your Westeros and your foresters. You have? <sighs> I was angry. But you're my family. No matter what, I'd follow you anywhere, little brother. Just try not to get us killed. Think we'd let you live without us, Westerosi? They say your homeland is fat and prosperous. An orchard ripe for plucking. We'll take what we want and kill anyone who stands in our way. There's no spoils without victory. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry about that. Victory is all we know. I'll show them their beds. Vasco wasn't exaggerating. Malcolm, you're here! And you found your soldiers. Anrath will be glad of your return. You came through for them. Just as I knew you would. What about you, Uncle? Will you stay with the Queen? If I can, I'd like to help her reclaim the Iron Throne. Imagine what an ally she'd be to House Forrester if she succeeds. Living here has made a better man of you, nephew. Thank you, Uncle. I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you. You've guided me well. You are your father's son, Asher. For all your differences, he would be proud. I'll send a raven ahead to Ironrath to let Roderick know you sail for Westeros with, um, cell swords. My thoughts will be with you in the fight to come. Asher. Iron from ice. Iron from ice. Casting off! <laughs>